Big day for high school softball. District play taking place for many schools. And we want to start with the Lafayette Fighting Irish. Lafayette in their dark uniforms taking on Excelsior Springs in the white unis. The Tigers had a one to nothing lead and will go to the third. Here's a hard hit to short from Jordan Pirarek for the Tigers. And this is a nice throw to Janice Roach at first. And the Irish playing good defense to the fourth inning. Lafayette trying to get the bats hot. And here's a bunt for Lafayette, but the ball pops up and back. And just high enough for third base to come and get the out to the sixth where the game really breaks open. Here's a big hit that travels deep into right field. That is Araceli Luis for the Tigers. Here comes the runs, and she's not just able to make it to third, but she also makes it home. That's a home run for Excelsior Springs. They take a four to nothing lead. And on a last ditch effort to try to do something for the Irish, they pop out into the outfield. Tough day for the Lady Irish losing four to nothing. They lose in round one of districts. We also want to take a look at some other district scores from today. Taking a look at Class 1, District 14, LeBlanc getting the win over South Holt, 8-5. Class 1, District 16, Jefferson getting the win, 3-0 over King City. Over to Class 2, District 7, East Buck getting the win over North Platte, 4-0. Lathrop gets the win, 6-0. Jumping over to Class 3, District 8, a lot of action in this district. Savannah blanking out Cameron today, 7 to nothing. Staying in Class 3, District 8, Macon gets the big win over Maryville, 12 to nothing. Staying in District 8, Chilcothy getting a big win as well over Benton, 15 to nothing. And then taking a look at Class 5, District 8, Central at Staley taking on Liberty North High School. Tough day for Central. They go down in this one, 8 to 3.